Hello, hello everyone. This is Sybil. Welcome to my channel. And really quick, I've got a couple of hauls to share with you. Super small. And a couple of beautiful cards. A little public service announcement that if you bought a D-Stash from me this last week, last week, um, your packages were mailed off Monday. And then somebody else purchased a D-Stash from me just the other day, and I mailed that today. And so most of them will arrive tomorrow, and the one that I mailed today should arrive by Saturday. Okie dokie. Now, I received two beautiful cards in the mail. This first one is from Lori, who is Craft and Blind, and that is her YouTube name and I believe that's also her IG name and Lori sent me a beautiful thank you card isn't it pretty I love it and I love the paper back here it's so so pretty um, because she won a giveaway and she sent me a nice thank you card thank you Lori that is so so thoughtful um, sometimes I don't ever hear from the person that wins a giveaway from me. So it's super sweet. Several ladies posted videos um, that had received giveaways from me. And then I did get a couple of emails from about three ladies saying they um, received my giveaway goodies. So that, that makes me happy that people acknowledge that they got them. It makes me feel good. I love to make somebody smile and share some goodies with them. So thank you, Lori. And also thank you for your very super encouraging note in there. God bless you, hon. And then this is from my sweet friend, Jill Norwood. Isn't she such a wonderful card maker? Oh, and then of course her curating Christmas. Love it. I know I participated it, participated in it one time for sure. I think I did it twice but I know I did one time and I'm really, really hoping I can do it again this year. Um, but I adore Jill. She has such a true, gentle heart, a caring, caring heart. And um, God bless you, Jill. I just love you to bits. You know I do. I love you. I love your crafting style and I love your beautiful heart and your beautiful soul. Um, and this says, where flowers bloom, so does hope. And um, she has not failed to send me cards since my cancer diagnosis. And she was one of the few ladies that I shared with privately before I let everybody else know on YouTube that I had cancer, breast cancer. And um, I really feel the Lord led me to certain ladies to share with that. And they've prayed me through. And they continue to pray for me. And send me encouraging notes, whether cards or emails, phone calls. And so I appreciate you so much, Jill. And your lovely words, you are a blessing. God bless you, hon, and Tim too. Okay, so I mentioned the other day that I purchased, silly, silly me, this um, swoosh die set from Paper Tray Ink, and I forgot to pick up the, the stamps to go with it. So sure, I can cut this out, but as you can see, you're not going to be able to read what, you know, make heads or tails of what that says. So I went back and picked up the holiday swoosh. And that is what the dies will say. Ho, 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 merry and bright. Happy holidays. Wishing you a merry Christmas and merry Christmas cheer. So I can stamp it, put the die on it and cut it out. And there you go. And those are the size. So those are that is the size sometimes I talk like I don't know how to talk all right there's that and then oh I loved this I saw this and fell in love this is the um, shape up snowman so there's the die so you've got his body or you can make a snow lady too you know and the little hats and scarf and the little stick arms and little tiny mittens. And then you can add this, the little faces. Isn't it cute? And buttons and snowflakes. So cute, love that. And then I also picked up the Paper Basics. 
40 sheets white cardstock. And this is, I think, is it a hundred pound weight? But when I first started um, Copic coloring, and I mean like in the very beginning, my friend Jan Gray, um, Jan Salisbury, as you guys know, are on Facebook, um, and I think it's Jan Gray here on YouTube, she was, I think, designing for Paper Tray Ink. And she had mentioned this was the paper that she used for coloring. Well, I purchased some. It's a great bargain. It's under $7, if I remember right, and for 40 sheets. And you, it color, you know, it, it accepts alcohol ink beautifully. So I picked up that. My favorite is Copic Express It paper, blending paper. But I also love paper tray inks paper. Okay, so really quick, I also picked up, here we go, whoa, almost dropped it and I picked it up. I picked up a sticky back of um, Velcro, two packages on Amazon, and then the Gorilla Glue. And then I had one little tin left after I sold all my um, distress inks, the little cubes, I had one left. So I put my little sponges in there and then I put the sticky back thing, you know, on here and then there we go. So that way I'm going to do that to all my colors and I have a, um, I have two organized more 60 count uh, ink storage units that hang up uh, on my wall above my desk. And um, so these fit in there perfectly. This doesn't bother it, you know, because it's almost equal to this. Anyway, so I, I have more of these and I plan on doing all of my Distress Inks. And I do plan on ordering the new Distress Inks. I've already put my order in um, with the person that I buy them from. And so hopefully they will come in next week or the following week. And I get the refills at the same time. And then I did pick up some super glue. This is the Gorilla Super Glue Gel because I was watching a channel and I apologize sincerely for not remembering the person's name, but she shared that after taking this off her ink pad, you know, taking the sponge off this about 20, 30 times, that this started lifting. And so she put a little dab of super glue under there and kept it down. So that's that. Now, if you've stayed with me, um, I'm doing a little giveaway. And this is for my US subscribers. And yes, you must be a subscriber and I need to be able to see that you are a subscriber when I use um, YouTube random comment picker. Uh, but I'm sorry, it is for US only. And I am getting ready to do a giveaway. It's probably gonna be a little, before a few more months, but I'm going to hopefully be able to do a bigger giveaway that will include everybody, all of my subscribers. But um, I won a giveaway from Jeanette Cawson on Instagram. And she is a beautiful artist and a really sweet lady. And um, she was giving away a bunch of her stamps. I think this was last year or the year before. And so I was the recipient. I won. And three of the stamp sets were from Simon Says Stamp. And so I decided after using these, then I was going to pass them on. So I'm, and this is how they arrived to me. And I said Simon Says Stamp. And here it says Hero Arts. This one's from Hero Arts. And she gave me a whole bunch of stamp sets from various um, manufacturers. But what I've decided to do is pass this on and then also include a couple of summer themed, you know, papers that would go well with this. Cause here you see the palm tree and there's palm trees here. So this is Doodlebug's Sweet Summer. And there's palm trees there. Super cute. Some of these papers I have used, so there's a few sheets missing, but not much. Okay, so you'll get that. And then Fancy Pants Summer Sun. So you get flip-flops, the anchor, 
bicycle whales really really cute and um, please don't mention that I'm having a giveaway in your comment just leave a comment like you would normally and just say something about what you're doing this summer that's it and then you're entered that's it um, so I only want this to be for the people that watch my video all the way through to the end and yeah if you're a subscriber you live in the US and you watch it all the way to the end just leave a comment. You can say something nice about the cards and say what a beautiful, what beautiful card you've received this summer. Anything, any comment with the word summer in it will be entered for my US subscribers. All right, thanks so much everybody. God bless. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Talk to you later.